Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? Fly here. Welcome back to the cast. Today we're checking out a relatively new game called Giant Machines 2017. Pretty much what happens... How can I relate this? Spin tires with vehicles with wheels that are bigger than your car. Just the biggest machines that do utilitality work in the world. So let's go ahead and get started. I think it works. It's pretty much like a campaign. So we'll play through one and we'll keep moving on to the new machine after we complete tasks. And uh, so on and so forth. Alright, here we go. Okay, sorry about that. I just kind of got a little distracted. Alright, so camera. So this is us right here. We're going to be moving here. Release the handbrake. Space. Okay, there we go. Damn, getting a little complicated here. Uh, wait, hold on. Let me look to the left. Uh, there was a small little road we could have followed. Uh, but we're going to the field workshop right now. Okay. Mm-hmm. use the workbench. All right, so pick up... <laughs> this music's so tight. Pick up the broken hydraulic hoses. Okay, now I just run into them. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I would park this, right? Handbrake. Engine. Get out. Okay, so pick up... Dude, this game is kind of cool. We got all these... Oh, my gosh. I mean, I thought this was just a game where you drive big shit around, but you kind of have some... Look at this. We're going to the workbench. E-repair. Huh. This game's kind of in-depth. I thought this was like, broom, broom, dump truck, fill it up, dump it off kind of thing, but cool. I, I like that. Well done, well done boy. So you're doing great. See, I could be a voice actor now. Okay. Yeah, I'll just stop reading that shit. The Aquator. Okay. So we got to put this cable or this hydraulic hose way up there. How do I get way up there? I don't use this thing. Well, I'm gonna get it so I can drive a little bit over there. What the fuck did I just hit? Oh, I can't put this in the vehicle, okay. So we're, so we're just gonna walk over here, we're sprinting. What the hell are we doing? I must be getting paid a lot for this. In real life, someone's like, yeah, go up there and put this hose connected back up. I'm like, yeah, you must be out of your mind. Okay, I look for some stairs. We got stairs over there and we also have stairs over here. Look how massive this thing is. No no way are there more than like two or three of these in the world. Holy crap. Okay, let's go to... Oh, no, that's blocked off. We'll go back around it. Okay, here are more stairs that go higher. Got another flight here. Oh my gosh, we're not even halfway there yet. Oh, we got a ladder. Oh. Okay, now the other ladder should be on the other side or over here. We're, at, we're actually not that far off. Oh my gosh, look how fucking massive this ladder is. Don't look down. Oh my god, fuck this. VR, I'd be freaking out right now. Now just don't look down. <laughs> okay. Now the, the next question is how the fuck are we, are we really just going to climb down this whole entire thing? We're climbing about a meter a second. One, no, two meters, 2.5 meters a second. We got another town over there. Now, guys, just, just imagine our train fever train coming right through here. That would be a game and a half. That's a game that's going to come out soon. Probably not. Okay, we're here. Yeah, danger. I love this uh, voice commentator. All right, so I'm just gonna go off this uh, ladder here. Just gonna climb down it, right? Just, just touch it. Oh yes, okay. Now I wonder if we can fall off this thing. Um, space jump. Oh my god. Okay, we're still alive here. So that that's kind of convenient. If we, if we ever have to go back up there. We can just jump off pretty much half of the uh, the ladder and just catch back on last second like this. Beautiful. See, I'm climbing down with my arms behind my back right now and my legs on the ladder. Very, very ergonomical. Okay, now we got more ladders here. 
There we go. It's actually pretty it's pretty smooth how to get up and down these ladders. Like some games, like GTA 5, I find myself just falling off buildings all the time trying to go down ladders. Okay, here we go. Um, e hold. Now what are these called? Electromat electromechanical converters. We on a spaceship right now? Now this giant okay. requires proper cooling. Turn on the two main fans using the lever on the back switch. Okay, now I need to make this thing stay cool. Back bridge, right down here. One more, we need to go down a flight of stairs, go to the right. Nope, one more. Is this like what we have to do to turn on the whole vehicle, or we're just kind of repairing it right now? Oh, oh we're trapped here. Let's go on these pipes. Oh, God. Oh, God, we can actually die in this game. Okay, let's go up here. Maybe this might be the route. Okay, here comes our cooling. It's air cooled. Beautiful. Oh god, we're being sucked in. Sorry about that. Okay, we got one more vent over here. Good. Okay, so we should be staying cool with the operation of this huge crane or mine. Go to the driver's cabin. Start the bucket wheel excavator. Excavator is what it's called. So we're going to be driving this massive vehicle. Okay, we actually gotta go down though. Start the bucket wheel excavator. Okay, hang on. Let's uh, l l let's go down over here. Oh my god, I'm about to die. <laughs> if I die this easily, no, no. Here's a door. Okay, we're gonna enter here. Oh my god, we're at the. Is our engine on? Okay, we turn this fucking radio off. There we go. Okay, we're gonna go forward here. We're really driving this thing right now. Okay, handbrake off. Oh, sorry. Wrong button. Okay, engine back on. Handbrake off. We're actually fucking driving this massive thing. The biggest tank in the world right here, dude. Okay, we're at 2.6 kilometers an hour. Oh man, this is, this is, this is tough here. This is like, kind of as big, well not, I don't think as big a platform as that uh, space shuttle delivery uh, tank that brought it from the um, NASA where they built the rockets and then where they took it to the uh, launch pad. And I think that one actually goes a little bit slower than this one. But uh, ri riveting gameplay here, we're almost to uh, the new position. Okay, yeah, there's, de there's definitely no gears in this thing. So we're almost there. <laughs> All right, we're gonna traverse it. Yes. Okay, we're trying to get a good line here. Okay, almost on center line. I'm gonna try to line it up right with this uh, middle bar. Okay, looking good. Got it all lined up. Full power here. 2.5 kilometers an hour. Actually, we need a little more to the right, it seems. Come on, big girl. I'm going to press shift. Okay, we're going a lot faster now. Just kidding. No, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're totally good. Almost there. Almost there. Okay, this should be good enough, right? I'll start turning to the left a little bit. Get nicer straight. Don't tell me we gotta we got drive another block. If it makes me drive another block, I'm just gonna leave this game. Even though it's kinda cool right now. Look at the staircase, it just it just hovers there. Like, I, that's, I bet that's like a real thing. It just stays there, suspended in midair. Okay. We're all inside of it. Good work. Nice. All right. Mission complete. Next, next. Well, yeah, we'll do another mission because I want to start mining. Bucket wheel excavator is operational now, so we can start extracting the silicone ore and filling our containers with it. Start the whole truck and take it to the unloading site of the bucket wheel excavator. Remember to monitor the hydraulic pressure levels. 
Going over the allowed maximum value will result in an emergency shutdown of the machine. You'll have to exit the machine mm. to reset the fuse. Okay, got it. Okay, so now, oh, this thing is massive. These these are the type of trucks they use in Canada to uh, mine out all that oil. Sh oh, was it shale or something? I don't fucking know. Okay, but <laughs> look how small the cabin is. Just look how mad we're like. We're probably two stories up right now. Okay, let's get into it. Okay, engine on. Parking brake off. Radio off. Okay, now we gotta bring this thing to the bucket excavator. We're gonna turn it to the right here. I wonder what kind of engine this thing has. Okay, I th we might be actually going away from it because the uh, icon's to our left. This thing has, does this thing have four tires in the front? No, okay, it has six in total. Okay, we, we gotta reverse this thing. Ooh, look at the suspension, looking nice too. It feels like I'm playing like, no, I definitely can't get through there. I, I was right the first time, gosh darn it. It feels like I'm playing in like a toy box right now. Like this thing shouldn't really be a thing in real life. I remember like back in the 90s. Yeah, way back in the 90s, boy, when I was a young pup. I used to watch VHS documentaries with uh, these big trucks in it. Dump trucks. Okay, turn to the left. I wonder if we can flip these things over. Oh, shit. Oh, we could so go over that in real life. Look how big those treads are. Massive. Okay, gear two. Gear three. God, quick shifting. Forty-five. That's not a bad top speed. Fifty? That's fifth gear? Oh my gosh, you know what we're doing with this thing? I'm gonna see how, how high we can climb it real quick. We got some rough terrain over here, but I'm pretty sure our wheels can take us over it. Come on, baby. Come on, come on. You better have some good torque in this thing. There you go. No, it does not like that. It's a very road-ish mega dump truck. Okay, but our original task was to get to the... Uh, oh, I'm stuck here. No, I'm in neutral. I think I'm kind of glitching through the ground right now. There we go. Okay, we're free. Yeah, original mission right here is to get park the haul truck. So pretty much what I think is we're going to back up the haul truck into that uh, conveyor bait. Conveyor bait. Conveyor belt area. Easy. Two-wheel driving. Um, and then park it so we can take the miner. The miner can deposit its silicon in here. Can I just please, please tell me I can go over these? You fucking asshole. This is so annoying right now. I thought the whole point of these dump trucks were to... Uh, I guess we still gotta follow the rules in this video game. Gotta abide by the laws of the road. Yo, I'm, I'm gonna go through here right now. Come on. Keep turning, keep turning there. Wow, this thing's got some good turn radius. Okay, there we go. Going through here. I love how those pipes had to build way above so these dump trucks would get there. Okay, 166 meters out. Don't clip the house, don't clip the fence, all is good, all is well. Okay, we're gonna swing this one back, uh, right back around and reverse it. Okay. Also, I feel like I'm playing like massively steroid construction simulator. Okay. Nope, not good enough. Make a little bit more. There we go. Okay, yeah, there, there's a fill bar right there. Okay. Dark day for rear. You got it, pal. Okay, so let's get out of here. I'm just going to jump off this rail. There we go. I'm dead. That was getting close, man. Okay, so our uh, dump truck is in position. Now I'm just going to take... So I think that's where we're... Where, how, how do we get up here? Sorry about that. I got a phone call from George Bush. Um, I think that's what I mine from. Pretty much these things are just like really razor sharp buckets that literally just grind into the uh, hilltop there. 
and all the debris and goods goes into the bucket and the bucket sends it down a conveyor belt into the truck. Okay, but we're going all the way over here for some reason. Oh, yeah, okay, so we're... Oh, god damn it. We're going to the um, cabin right by the uh, bucket excavator. Now, how do we get up there, though? Looks like it has a catwalk. Okay. Did I, miss, did I just miss a ladder? Nope. Oh, god. God damn it. Yeah, first day on my job. Don't really know the uh, ropes yet. Okay, I'm gonna go up here then. Okay, and now it looks like I'm getting much closer to the the catwalk right there. Okay, perfect. Yep, here's that ladder I went up initially. Should be one more, and that should be right to the level. No, oh, okay, here it is. Here it is. Oh yeah. Dun 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 dun. dun. Why is he going to my beat right now? No, that's not the song. I was thinking of... Okay, never mind. Here we are, though. Going on the ladder, into the hatch. Let's start mining, boy. Yeah! All right. Instructions, please. Okay, we're just going to start it. Start the wheel and begin gathering the ore. But be careful, Mitchell. To minimize ore loss, peel off relatively small layers of soil at a time. Okay. Gather a hundred tons of the raw silicon ore. We're mining for silicon in Dubai right now with the music. Just kidding. Okay, controls up. Engine, camera, handbrake, headlights, radio, rotate left, jib, jab up. Okay, so wheel on, wheel off. Okay, here we go. Wheels, oh, this shit is cool. Okay, we should, we, should, we should start going now. What does jib up and jib down mean? Here, let's try that. Okay, it's just up and down. Okay. Can we extend this at all? It doesn't look like it. We're just going to rotate to the uh, right more. I don't know how close we are to this thing. Oh, oh, we're, we're about to impact. Here we go. Here we go. Yes, there we are. Now, when it when we get it, it should drop it off onto that, yeah, see that conveyor belt up top? It doesn't really look like it's moving too much. No, it is moving. I don't know if it's gathered anything yet. Okay, well, let's keep mining here. God, a full bucket's going in there, dude. Easy, easy, easy. What, what the fuck just happened? We're good? Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep going. We've gotten five tons so far, collect it. S ten tons? <gasps> oh, there's a piece of ore. Look at it, guys. You see oh, God. Okay, we got 12 tons so far, though. Nice, nice and easy. Come on, nice and easy does it. I don't know, how, I, how do I see my hydraulic pressure on it? 20 tons. Come on, come on. There we go. We got a good chunk right there. 33. So this might take a little bit, so I'll come back to when we're at about maybe 900 tons. <laughs> okay, so we're at 569 tons. We just finished a whole sweep of it. As you can see... Oh wait, I don't know if you can... There. Uh, I don't know if you can, eh, it's hard to, yeah, there we go. So you can see that's all that we took out. Um, we don't have any more room over here to go anymore. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to raise this up a little bit. There we go. Just so we can kind of track back and get some of the other stuff. Or we could go down either or. Oh no, look. We've got some jammed right there. On that conveyor belt, you see that? What the fuck? I don't see any in our, any in our truck though. Maybe we haven't uh, released it yet or something like that. Okay, so let's keep it, let's keep it going up. Okay, now let's try this one. Okay, rotating to the left. I can't tell what it's getting getting right now. 
I should need to go a lot higher. Okay, right about here, because that's what we were getting last time around. Huh. Maybe if I get into the uh, pilot seat, I can move it back a little bit closer here. It's not... Wait, wait. Does it, is it getting sun right now? No. It's too short. Huh. Okay, so I lowered it a good amount. Maybe this one will work. Oh, yeah. Yes. 570. A little bit lower. A little bit lower. Digging. Digging in there. 590. Okay, we're going to try this route again. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Six thirty. Okay, we're at nine hundred. We might have to make one more sweep. Come on, come on, give us that. Yes, I, th I think we might make it. All right, perfect. One thousand. All right, good. It was automatically converted to the production quality. Wow. Going down to the unload. Okay. Fill the whole truck up with the material. Roger that. Okay, so let's turn off the engine. Let's put this over to the left a little bit. Stop the wheel. And then the engine off. All right, good. Okay, so now I need to go all the way over there. Let's get on this catwalk. And hopefully we'll just release a lever to all that for all that ore um, to spew out. Now, they, they were saying that it's production ready. Is that what they said? So we, we just go sell this ASAP. Yeah, I was trying to look for while we were mining if any ore was coming out of there, but I guess we just gotta flip that little switch right there and uh, it should be good to go. There we go, all the way down. And then we gotta come all the way, oh, no, no. Wait, where do I go? Oh, right here. And then now I could, I could go this way, right? Yes, the shortcut. Okay, flip the little switch. There we go. Oh wait, we gotta hold it. Okay. We can only do 275 tons worth. Forty? Yeah, there's, there's definitely not production ready silicon. It still has to be refined, I'm pretty damn sure. Okay, already at a hundred. You go to 275. All right, 15 off, 10 off, five. Go back to the whole truck and transport the ore to the container. Okay, so we're gonna uh, get back into our haul truck, as he calls it. Now, can I, can I go around this side? All right, good, yeah, because this is the only way I know to get down. And then we're gonna go back and then transport it um, to the depot, I guess you would wanna say that. I forgot what, what he just called it. Holy crap, yeah, look at these massive tracks. This is like on one of the, a, a P-1000 World War II tank. I think never existed, by the way. Look at these fucking tires, too. Look at that axle or drivetrain, whatever you want to call it. This is the drivetrain right in here. Look at that muff. Is that? Oh, no, that's the fuel storage. Why does there... I don't know how these big things work. Okay, up we go. I get this way. There's a shortcut for this side, and there's three different ladders on here. Holy shit. Okay, now we got to have to be careful with this load because the rocks might bounce off. Okay, tiller down. Okay, here we go. Oh, beautiful. Got some jazz. Okay, handbrake off. Now, does he, do these have physics on them? They do have physics, so we gotta be a little bit careful here. Now, let's just go back the way that uh, we, we came from. On the road, no off-road um, joyriding. Easy, easy. The rocks are fucking bouncing around. No, I'm pretty sure we, we could have taken a little bit more with these. It feels like we're missing maybe, I would say 500 tons. Actually, maybe even 600 tons. All right, slow left-hand turn. Yes. Oh, fucking awesome. Now, we just go off to the side of the road here, or do we need to go through like a gate up? What the hell is that? It looks like a jail. So we're going to stay on the road for this one. We're not going to take the shortcut. Not by a long shot. All this, all this ore will uh, fucking fall out. Okay, here we go. 
Easy. On the road again. I got my silicon ore again. Now we're just going to drop it into that bin right there. All right. I hope I can do this. This thing is definitely tall enough for it's backing to perch right over it. Okay. Easy. Like the front wheel can like sometimes jackknife this thing without even jackknifing. Okay. We'll just, is that good enough you guys think? No, we gotta, we're a little bit off centered here. Okay. I feel like I'm on, I'm on the same route again. No, no, that, that's much better. Okay, we're gonna pull out a little bit, just a little bit, just a little bit of pull out here. And now we're going to box down. Parking brake. Yes. It looks good to me. Come on, rocks or silicon. Look at the physics, man. This is pretty impressive. Okay, one down. It's like they're stuck in here right now. There they all start to go. Yes. We got some stuck in the corner here. We'll go a little more up. That's all. Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. Sweet. There we go, guys. So I hope you have enjoyed the first episode of Giant Machines 27. Thomas said 16. Oh, man. 2017. Until next time, guys, have a great day. Peace out.